Today we will be doing some lawn care on the Squirrel Farms map in FS17. We will be mowing a few residential lawns using the X Mark stand on in Laser Z. We will be heading over to the shop in our 2017 Chevy 2500 Duramax. Really quickly, we'll take a quick walk around here of our truck. This is by far one of my favorite Silverados. I really do like the crew cab with the 8 foot bed, the color match bumpers, and the stock wheels. It would be nice to see this truck in FS19. Let's hop here on the inside and head over to the shop. I'm excited to be back here in FS17 doing a throwback. I've been getting a lot of quests to do a throwback every single Thursday for you guys. I hope everyone's having a fantastic day today. Let me know how it is down below. My day is great and I now am on winter break, which is pretty exciting. I actually do have a few new series in the work. One will be back here in 17. I can't wait for it. Getting all the mods ready to go. And we should be up and running with this series within the next week. I'm excited to be back here mowing lawns in FS17. It's a very nice thing to do lawn care, and it's been pretty popular here on the channel for quite a long time. This Silverado here, 2500s, it looks awesome. Really do like the dark red as well on a lot of these trucks, it looks great. And we have arrived here at the shop, and there is our work truck. So we are using a 2012 Ram regular cab 2500. This is a great work truck. It's a base model truck, but it's great. We have the uh, stand on 48 inch, and we do have the X Mark Laser Z72 with a bagger. And this is on, I believe, an 18 foot utility trailer with a side ramp. I actually have been liking the side ramp lately. That way, we could get this one off without having to get this one off but let's hop here on the inside and head out to mow some lawns This is one of my favorite Ram pickup trucks. Hopefully it gets converted over to 19. It's awesome, especially with a somewhat of a decent interior, but the outside of this thing looks incredible. And we will be doing these two properties right next to each other. These uh, two here that both have a two-car garage. So we'll kind of park in the middle of them and we'll get going now. I'm thinking we'll use the bagger on one of them and use the uh, stand-on on the other. Sometimes customers do prefer to a bag and some just want a side discharge. It's actually easier for us to just kind of drop it. But let's get the side ramp done down. I think we'll first do the side discharge. That way it's a little bit quicker and faster. We'll get it backed off here and we'll get going. Let me know down below in the comments what is your favorite uh, lawnmower we have here in Farming Simulator. There are so many cool ones and I have released quite a few. Hopefully I could get back into releasing uh, mods as well. That would be a nice thing to do during the summer. I still really do enjoy uh, featuring FS17 here on the channel. There are still a ton of mods, a ton of cool things in 17 that 19 yet just does not have and I really want to continue to feature it. That's why we are starting a series back up and I'm very excited for it. Very cool things are coming uh, with that series. This house here has a little bit of a smaller property as well, so 48 inches isn't going to be uh, too bad as well. I hope everyone is excited for the holiday season and for the new year. I hope everyone sets some good goals for the new year to achieve throughout all the uh, days and months. 
I definitely have some cool things in the works for the summer months as well. I definitely want to get into uh, featuring more videos on the Subaru and other cars and uh, trucks. I think that would be an awesome thing and possibly some equipment. Even though we are out of season for lawn care, I will be trying to feature probably one or two every uh, few months. I think that's going to be a good thing to do. Our setup today looks awesome. From a distance, you guys can see that does look pretty cool. And I definitely want to uh, put a plow mount on this truck and go plowing. And I think that will be a great thing. So like I have touched upon, the new series for FS17 will be a landscaping series. It will be a pretty epic series, a lot of equipment uh, in a very nice shop. We'll try to use a lot of brands, not just one, uh, such as John Deere or Bobcat. So it's going to be awesome, and we'll have a variety of equipment ready to go for us. stand on looks so nice really do like it quite a lot and uh, these are great mowers here in the game I am in the works for some multiplayer content as well. Definitely want to try to feature more multiplayer. It is a bit tricky, uh, but I think that would be cool. So if you guys would like to join in on a multiplayer game, please let me know. And uh, we can definitely get uh, together and make some cool videos. I would say for this lawn, we'll probably charge anywhere from fifty to sixty dollars for it, and it probably takes us about a half hour, and that isn't too bad, as, uh, which is great. I'd like to thank all of you guys for the continued support on the daily videos. I really do enjoy uploading every single day here to YouTube. It's a great hobby, great passion of mine, and I really appreciate all the support. We do have a ton of cool things in the works. A new farming series coming, so many cool things. And we will be back to featuring other games on the channel as well, like GTA 5. There might be one this week if you guys are interested. I think that it will be a very exciting one. Some very cool new cars we are getting. Uh, for the house which should be awesome and some new trucks but we got this loaded up and that looks too good right about there let's hop on the laser z really do like this now the bagger does make it a little bit bigger uh, but this thing is perfect Always I do like to try to outline the uh, grass, that way it's a little bit easier. And I always try to have the uh, shoots facing away from the house. We do not want to leave grass stains on the house and possibly shoot any debris uh, towards the house like rocks or anything that could break a glass. So that's kind of what I do. I just try to be realistic, but I also want to have a great time in these videos. Now I have been looking into building a new map and I actually have found a few problems with it. Hopefully uh, we could build a new map. If not, I might edit a map and expand the town. I think that's a game plan if uh, what I uh, am trying to do does not really work out. This laser Z is making quick work of it. Having a, the right size equipment for the job really does help out and make it much more efficient. You guys can see a 72 inch deck compared to a 48 is a big difference already here for us which is awesome to see.
Let me know down below in the comments what is your favorite feature about FS17 and 19. Uh, both games are pretty cool, different graphics engines and different things like that, so it's nice to see all the uh, changes, but I think the mods in 17 are just so good, uh, good that we could still continue to feature it here on the channel. There are also some great maps and some other equipment that aren't yet in uh, 19 and some other uh, cool things we could do with the building materials and things like that. This is a pretty nice uh, shed here. We do have some projects coming up, working on some shed installs, building the concrete pad for it, everything like that. So, so many cool jobs that I cannot wait to tackle. And I think since the gas station is here, we'll actually stop there on our way back to the shop and we'll uh, get these filled up. Sometimes they do bring the gas cans with us, but I will have to say, uh, just stopping there filling up the uh, lawnmowers and the truck with the gas pump is a little bit faster as well. And we don't have to worry about uh, the smell and also spilling of the gas tanks. Front lawn is almost done here. Perfect, so that's all done. A little bit left here in the back, and uh, we should be good to go. Trying to clean up these last few areas, so it's, I believe it's just one pass here. We'll get loaded up, and we'll stop by there. I actually want to grab a snack and probably... Uh, uh, probably a Coke or Pepsi just to get as well as a nice refresh. It's pretty warm out today. Awesome, and touching up this last little bit. Perfect. We'll get loaded up here. Now, I definitely want to be realistic and empty the bagger, but it does not really connect, and I do want to find ways to do that as well. Let's kind of see how can we get to the gas station. I guess what we will do is just kind of back up just a little bit and uh, pull in there. That might not be too realistic to do, but it's going to save us a ton of time, and it's actually not too busy right now. Now with these throwbacks, I am trying to use trucks, equipment, and trailers that aren't yet in 19. So that's why you guys seeing me use a Ram like this, that Chevy, I really do like. Hopefully these all do get converted over. So I'll we'll actually park here in a way that we can use a both pumps. That looks to be good. And let's get the uh, Ram filled up. Now this does have a Hemi, which is great. Uh, sometimes for work trucks, you do not need the diesel. So let's come over here, bring it up, and put it in. All right, that's full. Let's come on this side and fill it up. Perfect, that's full. And looks like we are already at just a round. Uh, $45 for the mower, fill it up there, perfect. Uh, $60 for the mowers and another uh, 40 bucks here for the truck. And that's going to conclude our video. I hope you guys enjoyed our throwback to lawn care in FS17. Let me know if you guys are excited for more content here on the channel. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for our next one and subscribe for more.